Hello and welcome to careerguide.com. In this section, we are going to deal with ASP.NET interview questions and answers. Explain how a web application works. A web application resides in the server and serves the client request over the internet. The client access the web page using browser from his machine. When a client makes a request, it receives the result in the form of HTML, which are interpreted and displayed by the browser. A web application on the server side runs under the management of IS. IS passes the request received from client to the application. The application returns the requested result in the form of HTML to IS, which in turn sends the result to the client. Explain the advantages of ASP.NET. Following are the advantages of ASP.NET. ASP.NET application exists in compiled form on the server, so the execution speed is faster as compared to the interpreted scripts. ASP.NET makes development simpler and easier to maintain with an event-driven and server-side programming model. Being part of .NET framework, it has access to all the features of .NET framework. Content and program logic are separated in ASP.NET which reduces the inconveniences of program maintenance. ASP.NET makes for easy deployment. There is no need to register components because the configuration information is built in. To develop program logic, a developer can choose to write their code in more than 25 .NET languages including VB.NET, c -sharp, JScript.NET, etc. Introduction of view state in ASP.NET helps in maintaining a state of the controls automatically between the postback events. ASP.NET offers built-in security features through Windows authentication or other authentication methods. We have built-in caching features in ASP.NET. Explain the components of web form in ASP.NET. Server controls Server controls. The server controls are hypertext markup language elements that include a run at server attribute. They provide automatic state management and server side events and respond to the user event by executing event handler on the server. HTML controls. These controls also respond to the user events, but the events processing happens on the client machine. Data control. Data control allow to connect to the database, execute command and retrieve data from the database. System components. System components provide access to system level events that occur on the server. Explain how a .NET application is compiled and executed. Any code written in any .NET compliant languages when compiled converts into MSIL code in the form of an assembly through CLS and CTS. IL is the language that CLR can understand. On execution, this IL is converted into binary code by just-in-time compiler and these assemblies or DLLs are loaded into the memory. What is the manage execution process? Manage execution process is a process where CLR executes the managed code. The steps involved in this process are choosing the right compiler, compiling the code to MSIL, compile the MSIL code to native machine code, and executing the code with a variety of services available. What is an application domain? It is a way in CLR to maintain a boundary between various applications to ensure that they do not interfere in the working of any other application. CLR acts as a mini operating system where a single process may have various application domains. What is the pre-compilation feature of ASP.NET? It is a process where things that can be handled before compilation are prepared in order to reduce the deployment time, response time, and it also increases safety. Its main aim is to boost performance. It also helps in informing about the compilation failures. During deployment, it allows you to make changes to the web pages 
and reuse it using the same web browser to validate the changes without compiling the entire website. During deployment, it generates the entire website folder structure in the destination. All the static files are copied to the folder and bin directory would later on contain the compiled DLL. What is the common language specification? The CLS contains construct and constraints which provides a guideline for library and compiler writers. Any language that supports CLS can then use the libraries due to which the language can integrate with each other. The CLS is a subset of the common type system. The CLS is important to application developer because when developer design publicly accessible APIs for the CLS, those APIs are easily used from all other programming languages that target the common language runtime. Describe in brief the .NET Framework and its components. .NET Framework provides platform for developing Windows and web software. ASP.NET is a part of .NET Framework and can access all features implemented within it that are formally available only through Windows API. .NET Framework sits in between our application programs and operating system. The .NET Framework has two main components. .NET Framework class library and the common language runtime. .NET Framework class library provides common types such as data type and object types that can be shared by all .NET compliant language. The common language runtime provides services like type safety, security, code execution, thread management, interoperability services, etc. Difference between authentication and authorization. Authentication is the process of verifying the identity of a user. Authorization is the process of checking whether the user has access right to the system. Authorization is the process of allowing an authenticated user access to resources. Authentication always proceeds to authorization. Explain the various authentication mechanisms in ASP.NET. ASP.NET supports three authentication mechanisms Windows authentication, form authentication, and passport authentication. Windows authentication This is used for an intranet based application. It is used to authenticate domain users within a network. By default, Windows authentication is used. Form authentication It's a custom security based on roles and user accounts created specifically for an application. Password authentication. This is based on Hotmail Passport account. .NET Mobile Overviews. .NET Mobile is a platform for developing application for mobile phones. It is an extension to .NET Framework and is called Microsoft Mobile Internet Toolkit. It is a set of server-side forms controls. These controls produce different output format for example, WML, HTML, or even Compact HTML. This allows developer to create an application using a single paradigm instead of developing an application multiple times using different paradigms. The advantage is standardization, less redundancy, and Microsoft support. Difference between link and stored procedures. Stored procedures normally are faster as they have a predictable execution plan. Therefore, if a stored processor is being executed for the second time, the database uses the cache execution plan to execute the stored processor. Link support type safety against stored processor. Link supports abstraction which allows framework to add additional improvements like multi-threading. It is much simpler and easier to add this support through link instead of stored procedure. Link allows for debugging using .NET debugger, which is not possible in case of a stored procedure. Link supports multiple databases as against stored procedures, which needs to be rewritten for different databases. How are Windows services differ from other .NET application? Windows services are a way to create continuously running application in the background. They do not interfere 
with other applications and can be run whenever a machine starts. This can be paused if and when needed and quietly run in the background without the need of any user intervention. Windows services can be configured to run under specific user accounts. They run under their own Windows session and are ideal for tasks that need to be performed periodically or for monitoring requirements. Main difference between Windows service and other .NET applications lies in the fact that they run in their own Windows session without any user intervention in the background.